Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Zero, and welcome to Butcher Valley, a horror game where you're stranded in the woods and end up having dinner with a nice family. Delicious, great meal. You really outdid yourself this time, Mama. Well, these are the last meat cakes we have. Enjoy them. Did you kids set up the other cakes this morning? Yes, you can keep sending us out there, you have to raise our allowance. Maybe if you get the guest room ready for our next visitor, we can do something about that. Alright, but it may be a big raise. Do we have everything to make more cakes? We only have a little bit of meat left, but not for another batch of cakes. But that's it. We are also running out of apples. I better go outside to collect some from the trees. Something tells me... I think I know where the story's going. I told you I should have drived. It wasn't my fault. You know this truck doesn't obey the law of physics. Also, we have a fox sidekick. How much you want to bet it was the fuel valve? We needed a new one months ago. But we ended up spending all our money on that talking monkey. Hey, it was worth it. Anyways, we somehow need to find a new fuel valve somewhere around this forest. I'm not going to miss my opportunity to visit the port of Oak Angel. Let's get moving. Maybe there's a town nearby. Oh my god, look at how we run. We are the most eternal runner I've ever seen. That's... That is the run of a person who really likes heavy metal. The car broke down. We need to find someone who can help us. Some of a new fuel valve and time to spare. Whoa! I can roll, too. And attack. Butcher Valley. Hopefully someone here can help us with the car. This place is even listed on the map. Whatever choice we have. This is a very... ugly game. I, I mean ugly in like a positive sense, if that sounds weird. Like, it's really animated ugly. Like, look how everyone kind of moves and it's like really distorted. Hey, can you help us? What do you want? Our truck broke down back there. We are now stranded. I can't help you. I'm also stranded. It was day I was fishing down by the pier, and next day I know my boat is sinking. I'm on my way to Butcher Valley. Us too. Hey, what's up with that? There's a kick on the strange looking monument. I don't know. Took a bite of it. It's really good. Is it poisoned? My question is who made it? Hmm. Really weird. Stone monument only a cake in the middle of a forest. Who made this cake? Do you want to take a bite? Yes. Let's roll, Fox. God, everyone here is... Yeah. Our truck broke down back there. We are now stranded. Tough luck, kiddo. We're also stranded. We were driving towards the Port of Old Angel, then our car got stuck in the mud. And we found this mine with a cake on it. It's not never one of these mines back there. Who baked these cakes? Whoever they are, they make a mean cake. Can we try it? It's delicious. I have actually tried it. Never mind it. What are these cakes? Yes. There's another one. Hey, can you help us? Our truck broke down back there. We're now stranded. I'm stranded too. My grandson told me to stay here. He is getting help. Well, do you want to come up with the Butcher Valley to find someone to help us? No, you go ahead. I'm just going to sit down and wait for him. You sure about that? I'm just going to rest my eyes for a minute. Y'all look kind of monstrous, but I can't tell if that's a style or like... If the cakes are transforming you. Ooh, I can air dodge. Um. 
Hello? No one home. Turn the lights on when I get close. Rude. Is this Halloween? Oh, come on. This would left our lights on. Hello. Oh, hello. This is my house. Can I help you with something? Yeah, we got stranded in the middle of the forest. Our truck broke down. We need a new fuel valve. Can you help us? Sure thing. You're welcome to enter. My husband is really good at fixing machines. Maybe he can help you. We also have a guest bedroom where you two can rest. Great. Dinner is almost ready. Come join us. Oh, it's alright. You don't have to do that. Don't be silly. Let's go to the dining room. You can meet the whole family. This is Simon, Lewis, Naomi. With the Canleys. Nice family. Nice to meet you. These cakes are our specialty. We call them meat cakes. What do I get like weird dark crystal vibes? Maybe it's because they look kind of like puppet like. Oh, hey, Lewis. Ah, guests get stranded in the middle of the forest. They need a new fuel valve. All right, I have a spare fuel valve somewhere around the house. I hope you tomorrow morning. Hope the storm will calm down by then. Don't count on it, Dad. The storm looks really bad. Yeah, Naomi's right. They can stay with us until the storm passes by. They can stay as long as they want. This is the guest bedroom. You can stay here. Make yourself at home. There's hot cocoa and a slice of cake on the bedside drawer. Oh, thank you so much. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Why are the paintings staring at me? This is kind of creepy, don't you think? Let's not be rude to our hosts. We need to sleep. We have a big day ahead of us. Somehow, I don't think I'll be the rest of those. I'll be able to rest with those paintings staring at me. Thank you. These paintings are kind of creepy, don't you think? Kind of creepy. Those eyes send chills down my spine. What do we have here? How to taste like chicken, sleeping like a rock, the right way to butter yourself, and many of her books. What's that? There's a note beyond the bookcase. What does it say? It reads, A Letter to My Children by Alexandria. Let's eat some cake. This hot cocoa looks really good, but I'm not thirsty. I also don't have any appetite for the cake. Hey, wake up. Wake up. Oh no. It begins. What? Where are we? We're in the boiler room. What? The boiler room. They locked us here. We need to get out right now. We shouldn't touch any of this. Yeah, maybe it's a water filtering system, some kind of distributor. There's also a few boxes on top of it. Container key and knife. Two boilers both turned on. Two boilers. You know, this family was rich. I mean, they make the pies. A shelf holding boxes without any labels. Nothing more. Oh, found a nickel back there. Nice! Lucky me. Put it in the savings account. <laughs> Big safe me now, steal. There's also some metronome on top of it. Weird place to keep a locker. Interesting. You think what I'm thinking. Don't think about stealing it, dude. Stealing is wrong. These people locked us here. We should take their safety even things up. Nice. Let's go with the fox's idea. Well, all right, but let's promise we won't let the money change us. Oh no, it's really heavy. I don't think I'm able to carry it to the truck. I told you you shouldn't have canceled that gym membership. Fuel valve and screwdriver. What? There's a co- What are you? Oh, Alexandria. 
I am the projection of the soul of Axonity of the human. What do you mean, like a ghost? We are trapped here, can you help us? I will help you escape, but after you leave this room, I won't be able to help you anymore. Get out of this house as quickly as possible. Thank you. Oh, nice. House fuse box, pretty neat. Air vent screws. Hey, free screws. Um, I hey, uh, the uh, bags have smiley faces on. That's cute. What is that? Are the cakes made out of humans? I think these people are cannibals. I bet they were going to make us into cakes, too. What? What are you doing here? Um, I was just... Oh, I get cannibals. 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 Mom, the guests escape. No, wait. Let's get out of here, dude. Look at that knife stabbing motion. A dining hutch full of plates, glasses, and mugs. And the handmade. There's also a firearm up there. The wonders of Cranberry Lane. The right way to peel oranges and many more. There's a lot of travel brochures. Most of them are about the port of Oak Angel. The new sofa looks pretty comfy. There's a bowl of fruit on top of it, too. Yeah, at least I eat some fruit. A balanced diet. Landscape in my backyard is Secrets of Sod, Crest Avenue, Visitor's Guns, and other interesting titles. There's also a shiny trophy on top of the bookcase. Reads for extending performance in the arts of brushing your teeth. Small put doors, door there. Nope, that's, uh... Hallway. And what about this door? No, I don't think I can go in there. It's locked. It's locked. There we go. It's just a little funky sometimes. What are you doing here? Please don't tell anybody. I was just going to go. I won't tell. I just wish I could have played before you got in a cake. No one wants to play with me. I'll play with you. Help us get out of the house. Okay. What are we doing? What are we playing? It's really just like dice toss. I win, right? That was easy. Your game sucked. Well, that was a good game. How about you, like, help us get out of the house? That was unfair. What? You cheated. That was unfair. Oh God! It's a boss fight. Jump over your enemies. Dodge slow traveling projectiles. Shift. Dash through your enemies. They won't be able to hit you. Use your knife to attack enemies. We got. Man, we are like, we are a JoJo stabber. We are, we mean business. Look at this stabbing, look at this. The can hold up. Under our fury. <laughs> Like, we're the dangerous ones here. One down. Three to go. Oh, 
ice. There's a painting equipment inside the desk, a big crayon on top, and a bunch of coins inside the storage drawer. There's a lot of toys on the floor blocking my way. There are four toy cars, three small boxes, and a teddy bear. Also, it seems to be a toy hybrid between a duck, a lion, and a fish. Never one of those average dragons taking care of that car dogging earwax festival. The rubber books were difficult to see because of the cobwebs. I've been collecting dust for at least five years. Okay, so look, look, unlock this. Look, it's the dad. What are you doing here? You should be in the boiler room. I'll put you back after I find my missing screws. I have a bunch of screws. Missing screws? I lost three screws around this room. I need to find them. I can find them for you. You help us get out of the house. Whatever, just don't break anything or you'll go back to the boiler room and straight to my stomach. Are we just gonna help people and like, they're just gonna be like, sorry, I didn't, I'm not gonna adhere to the deal. So you're a good handyman, the smelling motor, and many of her books. I was like, couple boxes labeled electronics. Containers, each with its own label. Scrap metal, nuts and bolts, nails, copper wire, and many others. I was gonna say... What are you doing in this tool board? Two hammers, three wrenches, a few duct tape rolls, and a saw and level. Great stuff. They were just everywhere. Here you go, three screws, sir. Okay, good. Oh yeah, I also found these other ones earlier today. Wait, are those the screws from my air vent? Uh, no. I just installed them yesterday! Okay. Dodge those. We dodge that. Get rid of them back here. Demaku, Demaku, Grezu. Almost there. Come on, come on. You win! You should have picked the right tool for the job. Good one, dude. You really got the point. Master bedroom key. I have a feeling you're all not dead yet. It's locked. No, oh, what's left then? Nice. Stone statue in the shape of a star. Then five candles on top. Stone statue in the shape of a person. Then three candles on top. Stone statue in the shape of a cube. Then three candles on top. It's locked. Go back to the boiler room, you're next to the menu. We won't go back. Let us out, no one else will get hurt. Naomi. Yes, Mom? I'll have to finish cooking tomorrow's meal. Catch him and I'll raise your allowance. Consider it done. You two are gonna stay here. Oh, you're gonna shoot music notes at me. I already feel it. Don't touch anything. I'll make sure you get a cake before tomorrow morning. You can't do this. We're living beings. Shut up. I have to learn these notes. No one wants to listen to my songs, but whatever. I'll listen to your song if you help us get out of the house. I don't... No. 
Oh, come on, I'm sure you're good. Let's hear it. All right. There's a new piece I created. It's called the Constraints of Butcher Valley. It sucks. Yep. How long how long does this song go on for? Wow, great song. You liked it. Yes, totally. Oh no, you didn't like it, did you? Uh, what? You didn't like it. Whoa. Bear boomerang. This game is so, uh... This one's like jank core. <laughs> Come on. One more. We win! Just record, I did like the song. I didn't. There's a xylophone here next to a few boxes labeled My Stuff Keep Out. Also a pan flute, boxes labeled Musical Notes, and a fancy harp on top of the shelf. Music Fury, the Chronicles of Percussion, and many other books about music. There's a lot of crossword puzzles. Most of them are already finished. A lot of instruments here. A harp, a triangle, and a xylophone. Well, there's a few of these gems here on the floor. There's a couple of notebooks inside the drawer, my diary, and to-do list of things to do, too. A grand piano of music notes and a book on top. There's also a banjo and a tambourine hanging on the wall. Let's go back in the master bedroom. I'm gonna get to explore here. The right herbs and spices for the human dish. The spano cord of Morse code. Many more. What is this? A lot of currency from many different countries? Don't mind if I do. Nice, Louie. You have your priorities right. There's a shiny skull decoration on top. And the clothes inside the drawer. Firm mattress. Firm pillow. We done here? Oh, you're still here! I defeat your son, your husband, and your daughter. Let us go, you will suffer the same fate. How about I eat you instead? You got- Whoa, 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 whoa! What are those? You're like a ninja Gaiden boss. There, there was, there was a few bosses that are kind of like you. Like, like, I'm not even joking. You, you literally play like a ninja. I don't mean like the Xbox ninja guy. I mean the you know, the Nintendo ninja Gaiden. Oh yeah, I can't kill the apples.
I can't tell like what those are. Are they like, like crawdads? I win. I'm glad this is over now. You did it. Now let's get out of this house full of cannibals. Two more cakes. There's a couple of cranberry branches on the side. Well, someone's already preheated. Good thing we escaped the boiler room. We will up in here. Can't imagine what's in there. Oh, never mind. It's only milk, soup, and more fruit. You know, I was making the only human flesh. No, I never, we discussed this. They have a balanced diet. Currently empty, like my soul. This microwave looks customized, like my soul. Still a few dirty dishes in the sink. Also, some water leaking out of the pipes. Let's go. We're out of here. Seems like they're still alive and very pissed. Run? Run for your life. I will twirly blade my way out of here. Whoa. Somewhat disorientating. You're also shooting music notes. I got. I just, we didn't even like. There's like not even animation for getting in the car. We just like. We just run into the front hood and we're driving. We're backing out, man. We're, we're going down that lane. But your valley don't trust strangers. They might eat you. True. So that's it for Butcher Valley. Uh, this developer looks like they're making, they've made a couple other games. I haven't played them yet, but the uh, one in particular also has a kind of grotesque style. Uh, more so than this, actually. It was, you know, three dimensional, not 2D like this was. But I'm kind of feeling out, it looks like they're trying to make, maybe not necessarily a connected series, but a series of games with a certain aesthetic. And I think the aesthetic is actually pretty charming. It's, it's all the way out there, it's very weird. It's a little flash gamey, at least this one, maybe not the other one that they made. But it's weird in a good way. The the boss fights were very easy. And only like the final couple of ones had like any more advanced patterns or anything. That'd be my only complaint. But the boss fights were also so like surreally chank almost on purpose. Like look at the knife animation. That in in a real game, I'd be more critical of that. But in like a free kind of 30 minute thing. And just as an overall like aesthetic and kind of look, it kind of fits. It's weird. It's it's a weird experience. It really kind of matches in a very weird way. But yeah, I think that about sums up my thoughts on Butcher Valley. I wouldn't be surprised if there's there's sequels to this. It kind of seemed like they were setting up characters because there was a talking fox. Anyway, so thank you for watching play Butcher Valley. I'll see you guys later, and take it easy.